Using Android Auto and the new Chevrolet Cruze is easy and only takes a few simple steps to set up. In this video, we're gonna show you how easy it is to use Android Auto in the new Chevy Cruze. The first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is to connect your micro USB cable to your Android phone. When you do this, you'll hear a beep, which means that the phone is now connected to the Chevrolet MyLink system. You're gonna be prompted to be able to switch over to Android Auto. Once your phone is connected using Android Auto to your car, you can set your phone down and just use Android Auto for all of your media, phone calls, text messages, Google Maps, and other apps that you can download inside of the Play Store. Receiving a text message in Android Auto is seamless. You can be driving down the road, keeping your eyes on the road, and receive a text message and never have to look at any screen or your phone. Once you've received a text message, all you have to do is simply tap on that message. Here's the message. Did you get the tickets to tonight's Tigers game? You can press the voice button and say reply. At this point, you can press the voice button that's located on your steering wheel to reply, or you can just keep on going about your day. When using Android Auto, receiving a phone call is very similar to a text message. From the home screen in Android Auto, you can easily access previous missed phone calls or call other people. Simply tap on the phone icon. You'll instantly see a list of people or recent interactions or call history. In the upper left hand corner, there's a menu right next to the phone. This will allow you to be able to dial, listen to voicemail, check call history and missed calls. Another feature that many drivers are gonna appreciate is Google Maps. With one touch of a button, you're instantly routed to where you're at using Google Maps. In the upper left hand corner, there is a menu. From this menu, you'll be able to see recent places, categories, and even traffic. To give you an example, let's select the traffic icon. As you can see, there's medium amount of traffic in our area right now. In the upper right hand corner, you'll notice a search bar. This will bring up a keyboard and you can easily type in your destination. In seconds, it'll find your search query and route you directions to get there. Android Auto also allows you to connect to all of your music and playlists right from your phone into the car. Simply tap on the headphones icon and you'll be connected to all of the music that you have on your phone. Press play to be able to hear the bass. What's neat about the audio player is that it acts just like your phone. So if you'd like to be able to go through the menu, scroll down, find other songs that you'd like, you can do that right from this interface. Let's say you don't like this song. Simply tap on the three dots right to the right and you can either thumbs up or thumbs down the song depending on if you like it or not. 